What's up guys? Welcome back to Unbox Junkie. My name is Matt. Today we're looking at another Xiaomi product. This one is the Electric Sonic Toothbrush. I've actually been an owner of the Philips Sonic Toothbrush for probably like two and a half years now and I love that thing. The beauty of the Xiaomi Sonic Toothbrush that I haven't seen in other toothbrushes is that this actually connects to the Mi Home app. This thing will actually give you a brushing score based off of how long you brush your teeth, how much uh, of your teeth you're covering. Yeah, let's just open this thing up. All right, so we got a box. We've got the unit itself. Oh, look at that. That is clean looking. Okay, so I got this so we can actually see what we're looking at here. All right, uh, you know what? Here, let's do this. There we go, that's better. Okay, so it looks like we got a couple extra O-rings here. We've got the top, and it's got a nice sealed sanitary package. So there's a standard mode, a gentle mode, and then there's a custom mode that you can customize with the app. I don't know what that means, but uh, apparently you can customize it. Now on the back you can see it has these nice little grooves. It's supposed to be 100% IPX7 waterproof, so you don't have to worry about anything getting damaged in, if you brush your teeth in the shower. Some people do. There, there we go. Very clean looking. Oh, 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 It's those aren't O-rings, so you can just, okay, so that's kind of cool. So this is just to color coat the bottoms. Say you buy more of these, one for you, one for your spouse or your kids, and you can color coat them. So that's pretty cool. I'm digging that. I'll go with the standard, though. So the charging station, um, it's as simple as just setting it on there, and it should start charging. It uses a wireless charging. So let's just plug it in and see what happens. So as soon as you put it on the dock, that lights up. Now the battery life itself should last you about 18 days, but you know, if you have this just set up, I mean, you're just gonna, you're, you're probably never gonna run out if you, this is how you store it. Now the motor itself will shake 31,000 times per minute, so it's really fast. Oh yeah. Got some water, got some toothpaste. And I already brushed my teeth today, but hey, you know what? Why not brush it again? Okay. Mm-hmm. Wow. I just splashed myself in the eye with toothpaste spit water. Ugh. That's very interesting because the uh, standard mode, it feels more aggressive and then yeah, when you put it on gentle, it it's like, I don't know how they're doing it, but it feels a, it do, it feels more gentle. Being somebody who actually uses a uh, Philips Sonic toothbrush, which is like the more widely known one, um, yeah, this is very comparable. Uh, let's try the app out. How do we add? All right. Oh, it's already detected it. Okay, cool. So you see how this is all in English right here? I'm hoping that once this part is done, we'll be able to see everything in English. I really hope so. Okay, so as you can see, the the Mi Home app. Um, is in English, but unfortunately with certain devices they don't have an English pack for it So the inner app for the toothbrush is all in Chinese. The hardware is great. The hardware is fantastic It is very comparable to the Philips Sonic head if not better because of the application big huge downside is Xiaomi even though they're getting to be a multi-billion dollar company, why do you guys not put English in your software? What is the deal? Put English in your software, Xiaomi. I'm calling you out. I'm calling you out right now. There's a great toothbrush though. If that doesn't bother you, or you know, you don't really care to even use that function, even just by itself, it's fantastic. It, it, it works just like the other well more known brands here in the US. The quality feels just as good. I actually like the stand. It's a lot more discreet than my other one. I think Xiaomi, uh, again, nailed it with creating another awesome product at a better price. Um, this one's only $46. For my Philips Sonic head, I think I paid like 160. And that's insane. Like a third of the price, you're gonna have the same functionality. And then when Xiaomi decides to start putting English in their software, you'll have the capability of monitoring your uh, your brushing habits. Yeah, I still think it's worth it. All right guys, that is it. I'm gonna leave it in your hands. I'll leave links down in the description below. But as for now, get out of here. 